Hello guys, here we are at the eastern front. It uh, snowed a couple nights ago and then rained, so I figured it would be, wouldn't be any snow in the woods. Half ways down, I started seeing a lot of snow, then all of a sudden, none. Until I got up here. Most of it's melted away now, so it's pretty hot. The sun's out. Anyways, this is where I do my dig my trenches for many years. Get over there, have a look. I haven't fallen my ass. There we go. Almost got skunk today, and a couple little pieces of ore showing up nuggets, and about a half a bucket or so of stuff I'm going to bring home. The trench is all full of snow here right now. The it doesn't go, it goes over here a little bit. I can show you. A buddy of mine takes that dirt home. Does this thing with it? I think he finds he finds quite a bit. Six hundred pounds, I believe he had last time. He was down here. I got about two grams over that. So that's bad. There's a big hole there. I don't want to step in. Another one. <clears throat> got a few. Big, big piece, big ore down there. We can go hours and hours to get the, the pieces that are so big. Yeah. Down to a boot here. Uh, like in the 1800s, mid 1800s, I'd say. There were a lot of prospectors around here, and uh, you can still find their trenches they were digging. A lot of them are okay. Some of them I wouldn't want to venture too close to them, because you don't know how deep they are or none of that stuff. I'm not going to go over there because the snow and I don't know how deep that trench is over there. I don't want to fall in it. Right over there with that fallen tree. There is an oak crop with a beautiful vein in it. Crops there, and then back in the woods a little bit, it comes up through again. I chipped a lot of quartz out of it, but it wasn't, uh, it wasn't really anything in it. But down over there is a, a bank, and a little stream down there. I used to find gold in there, but it's kind of boggy. Uh, step in the wrong place, you go up to your ass and mud. Uh, once the snow's all gone, the weather's better, and there ain't no flies. I get back into it again. A lot of places over here need to start a trench again. Get all down in there. It's good to. Little one going there it was just nothing in the wood at all, and then ten feet away over there, we're finding big pieces of quartz, you know, ten, fifteen pounders. But it's a great day to be out anyway. We're just sitting around the goddamn house all day. But I better be. I wonder what happened. I take a picture of that sun. I forget like Donald Trump. 
Fuck, never mind. Uh, I'm going to get ready to bugger off. By the time I get out of here, hope the snow's melted on this road. I don't want to get stuck in here again. Nice spot, quiet. See a beer once in a while. But, uh, maybe they sit there and look at you for a little bit and leave. Uh, that's a dead tree. There's quite a few of them in here. tree just down yonder there. Just about 10 feet up from that. There's a, had a little trench going there one time. And it's uh, all that rusty quartz in there. It's just full of it. Okay, I got some pretty good gold over there. Let's try it again. Maybe this summer. Right here, trees are growing up here now. There was no trees here. Numbers started coming around. Right there, I pulled some sweet big pieces of quartz out of there. A lot of big rocks in there. And uh, can't see much of the trench left anymore. I think no deer up here at all. Can't see any tracks. And quiet. I don't even hear a bird singing. Watch where you're going there, brother. Where you end up coming them holes. Well, it was a pretty good day. Yeah, there's probably some nice stuff in that dirt. I'll have to show you what I what I did find. I say it almost got skunked. I don't think I ever got skunked down here. Maybe once. <clears throat> There's that big damn piece of ore I pulled out. Jeez, it took it days and days coming down here trying to get that out. And it ended up being twice the size. It was two pieces. I had to break it in half. There's no, nothing in the other one. She beat the hell out of the other one. Never even found a speck. Uh, that thing's about 80 pounds in one piece. There's my. Let's see. I'm taking home with me. There's some nice, nice ore in there. See the sand. You can pan this stuff here. Find it. I don't bother with it too much. You just save it for other people who want to do it. I have found small nuggets and stuff in there. But I didn't really look through it today. Let's see my like these a little bit. Yeah, these are the pieces I found today. I just got one little piece, one little nugget on it. And this one. It did have a nugget on it. Just a little, little tiny little speck there. For the look of it, it goes right into the rock pretty far, so I think it's a good piece. I'll hang on to them. Now, I sure got all my, all my gear here. Oh, this is my old stomping ground. My happy spot. All right, guys, take it easy, wash your hands, and uh, talk to you later. Bye.
Oh, I was just a scud in the north.